Hi guys, um, after some delay because I was being lazy, um, I fixed um, some use cases where my LSM calculator will fail. Namely, if um, if there are more subnet, then that can be fit inside this this starting network. Um, you have to tell the user that they are they are um, they will not be allocated because the starting block is full. Okay, so that's one. And also, um, what if you provide a um, valid IPv4 address, but it's not a um, it's not a network address? So you have to convert it into a network address. So um, those two issues were already solved by TJ. Um, so I just uh, had a look at his solution and implemented it. Didn't take long, maybe 30 minutes or less. So this. These are the TJ's work. I just um, put it at the front of my code. And what I did was here, um, I use his functions to um, first uh, get the base in as a um, or octets um, and then also get the prefix get them from whatever um, network address that the user has input and then uh, convert the network base to a unsigned number and then um, use that and the prefix to convert it into a network address in a unsigned number form and then convert that back into a quad or octet format okay so uh, this takes care of um, if the user enters a uh, address that is valid IPv4 address but it is not a network address then this takes care of that and um, here um, I just added some code so that if the parent block is full and you can no longer allocate more subnets then it will tell you okay so um, so basically if the if it is full then you set the two large marker as full and you um, suffix it at the end of each subnet okay so if it's full it will tell, tell you it's full and then it just uh, works by updating the range remaining okay so um, that's what I did so let's um, demonstrate so Firstly, um, let's um, put it into this calculator. So, I mean, this example A is 100, B is 100. So, these are the host size requirement for each subnet, right? 50, 50, 10, okay. 50, 50, 10. And you don't need F for this example. And then if we submit, we tell you that subnets A and B are allocated successfully, but not the other three. Okay. They are, um, colored in red in this case because um, 
you can't allocate these three subnets because the major network block is already full okay so let me use my my script to do the same okay so that's my script N network is 192.168.00 slash 24 and the subnets are a um, b um, c d and e okay so uh, a is 100 b is 100 c is 50 d is 50 e is 10 okay so it tells you over here um a and b are allocated okay with the C C R D R of 25 each same here C D E um they are not allocated it's full okay so um everything matches so that works okay what about the second condition what if I change this into I don't know 50 this is not um, a valid network address okay so it should be converted back to a network address and it does okay we, we've typed in this but we got sorry but we got this okay and it gives you the same result so um that's it. Thank you very much. Happy hacking.